Hi guys, do you want to make this masking effect before your zooms? Let's get started. Add your clips one below and one on top. The top clip will be used for zoom ins and masking. Also, we will be adding shakes. Adjust the top clip so it starts at the beat mark of song when the zooms start. Cut one frame off the zoom in part. Bring it back 30 frames, then pre-compose it like I do. Select the pre-compose layer, hold Alt on your keyboard, and drag it forward 30 frames to match it with the zoom in part. On top bar, select this to equip Roto Brush. This will help us mask the body of the pre-compose layer. By the way, double tap the pre-compose layer to use the Roto Brush. Also set the resolution to full. Click and drag your mouse over the character body. The part inside the pink outline will be shown. If you hold Alt before clicking, it will remove the outline part. We want to make an outline where the whole body is inside the pink outline and there is nothing that's missing. By the way, if you hold control key on your keyboard, then click and drag left or right. This will scale up or down the circle for Roto Brush. Also check for any missing or useless parts. It's easy to miss. Make sure to remove or add. After we are done, click the freeze option. This will add keyframes to the whole composition. You can also use Feather and Roto Brush, but I don't need it, so I won't be using it. Make a keyframe for position at start of the pre-compose layer. Press P on your keyboard to show position. Drag the position of pre-compose layer all the way down at the first keyframe. Go to the end of the layer, then drag the position of the layer to default position values. Select the keyframes, press F9 on your keyboard. This will easy ease the keyframes and make it smooth. Open the graph editor. Select your keyframe. You can use my graph or make your own. After we are done, make an adjustment layer. Add S underscore shake effect to your adjustment layer. Go a few frames forward, cut the adjustment layer. Now I will skip ahead. I will add zoom and twixter to my clip. I would recommend adding very fast zooms. Press F3 to show effect controls. Set amplitude to 0.3 and set frequency to 2. That's it, hope you liked the tutorial. By the way, I just want to say sorry, I didn't upload Trio Edit tutorial as it wasn't anything special. So I made this new tutorial from scratch to show you my old Trio Edit masking effect plus shake. I will still post the tutorial, but only the start half part of it because I already posted the Why Shake tutorial of that new Trio Edit. See you guys in the next one. Bye.